Do you guys want to play levels like these, but the platformer controls on a computer are just super awful, and you can't figure them out, because you gotta, like, click the, the arrow things, and the space button at the, and, like, click the mouse at the same time, and you wish you could just do it simply and easily, like how the YouTubers can do it? Well, I'm gonna teach you how to, how to n correctly enable them on, like, Bluestacks. If you're using any other emulator, haha, -ha, sucks to be you, because this tutorial for Bluestacks. And um, I'm gonna teach you all how to how to correctly use the platform mode and um, beat levels in platformer mode, like how I'm doing right now. If I could figure out how to, there you go. Okay, so you would just do like this, and then you would do like that and that and that and. Then. But like, how do you, how do you do that? So I'm gonna teach you all how to do that. So you click this little thing that says game control that looks like a little keyboard icon. And then you would click controls editor like so. Um, now what you would do is um, you would click uh, D-pad. Make sure you have it set to custom. But click D-pad and then get rid of these. And enable these keys to right arrow key and left arrow key. Um, I already have it set up, but you have to have it overlaid with the um, actual platformer mode buttons. If they aren't overlaid with these platformer mode buttons, like how it showed right here, like if they're over here, this will not work. So you have to have them over here, like how I have them. Let me just get rid of this. I don't need this. And for the space button, you literally could either just not do it at all and just rely on the mouse for clicking. Or if you want to do space button, you literally just click once and click space and boom, that's now your, your space key. I already have it, so I'm not going to re-enable it. But yeah, that's how you would set up platformer mode controls. And then you can just play levels in platformer mode on the Geometry 2.2 private server. Keep in mind, this is only for uh, blue stacks. I'm not doing a tutorial for any other emulator for the 2.2 private server. This is solely for the blue stacks version of the thing. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it to, to that. So, um, I mean, thank you all for watching this tutorial. Um, make sure you like and subscribe to see more uh, fun, funny videos. Some My videos are funny sometimes. Sometimes I have funny videos that I make. Um, but, yeah, if you want to see more content, click subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.